after you've installed Bet Angel, um, you're presented uh, what? Well, after you've installed it and clicked on the icon, you're presented with this logon screen. Um, and I'll just discuss a couple of things around the login and how to register your account. To register what you need to do, you can't log in automatically without having registered. So the first thing to do is to register. So if I click on register, you can see here it's asking you for three bits of information. The first bit would be um, a serial number, so you know, you would type in whatever your serial number is. Um, then you would type in <coughs> your Betfair username. Now obviously you wouldn't type in my Betfair account, you type in whatever your Betfair username is. And then type in your email address. Then all you need to do is click on register account and what this will do is it will contact our server, authenticate um, the fact that you've bought the product from us um, and this will grant you access to Betanger. You won't get an email or anything, you'll just get a confirmation message um, via the screen saying yep yeah, that's registered and that's fine. If there are any problems from there you can contact support and they can help you out from there. But once you've registered you're free to log in to your Betfair account. So at that point you would type in your Betfair account, um, your password. Your password is going to be um, encrypted. We never have access to your password. Um, when you log on, you're logging on to Betfair. All we're doing is basically transmitting that information to Betfair and you're logging on from there. We obviously need to know your Betfair account um, name because we have to submit that to Betfair uh, for a number of reasons. We also uh, need to obviously authenticate that with us. But you never should give us your password. The password's encrypted. Um, you can remember the username by clicking on this box here, but we don't allow you, for security reasons, to store your password anywhere whatsoever. Obviously, it's very security is very important when you're talking about money, um, so we want nothing to do with the password, and we won't allow you to store it. You're going to have to type that in every time, I'm afraid. If you want to trade markets that are designated as Australian, um, you'd have to use your Australian wallet, so you can tick that. But most people. Um, would only use that on certain occasions so you generally leave that unticked. If you tick it and you log in and you've got no money in your Australian wallet your account balance will show a zero so you need to be aware of that. Select the currency that you wish to use um, and here you can see the connection mode. Connection mode is quite a clever uh, way of configuring BetAngel. It basically ensures that you get the best possible connection to Betfair. If you want to learn more about that skip into the knowledge base and have a read. You also need to make sure that you've got I accept Betfair API terms and conditions uh, ticked. Um, and then basically, if you've registered the software using this link here, then you can log on uh, to your account from, the, from here just by clicking log on. Once you've registered the software, there's no need to register it again um, unless if you've been issued with a new serial number. Uh, so it's that simple. Uh, there isn't a great deal that you have to do to get yourself up and running.